As parents in general, I think all of you parents out there will agree that our greatest wish for our children is that they not only be successful, but that they find someone to love and care for, and someone to love and care for them when we no longer can. And also as parents, we tend to set an imaginary bar in our minds. Is this person indeed good enough for our little boy or our little girl? Well, let me tell you here today that Leanne and I have been truly blessed. That bar in our minds that we set so high has indeed been exceeded. Many British miners moved to the United States to mine coal in the 1800s. Some of that beadling family and some of this bone family moved to Allegheny County at the same time, probably on the same ship, to work in the same coal mine. Two families, generations apart, coming together again. Today, the bands of metal we slip on each other's fingers may reflect our devotion to one another to the outside world. But more importantly, today, it's about combining and joining our souls until the end of days. And I will love you forever. Now, with this ring, I am truly honored to take my next big step in life with you as it becomes our life together and forever. And again, I love you. Together we're unstoppable. We've been together for seven years, but that's not nearly enough time. The short time we have on this earth together. I want to be with you. I want to spend my own life with you. Ladies and gentlemen, we present to you, for the first time as husband and wife, Robert, Robert and, and Samantha, Samantha Bone. Bone. <laughs> The most dangerous thing Rob has ever attempted came in his 20s. Internet dating. Like myself, his father, a generation before him, my son had finally found the greatest blessing of all, someone to share his life with. So Sam lit up the room when you came into this world, and you still do to this day. But a special light shines in your eyes when you're with Rob. And it makes me very happy as your father to see you with a man that loves you and, and you truly love him. If I could give you both a bit of advice from 40 years of experience, always say please and thank you to one another. Never take one another for granted. And always remember, if you were to be truly blessed, your hair will turn gray, and gravity and time will take their toll. But the same beautiful person that you see in one another's eyes right now will still be there, yearning to still be loved and valued and cared for. Rob and Sam, may your troubles be few and your blessings be many. Cheers. Let's toast the man who raced the track, not the other cars, and won his trophy, the pretty girl at the finish line, now his wife. Samantha and Rob. The world is a better place having both you in it individually, but especially having you both in it together. To Rob and Sam. <laughs> never a right time or a wrong time to get married in life, only a right person, and I do believe she's standing in front of you today.